very few places in the world where you see this kind of innovation coupled with this kind of energy and scale. These are things that, as a, a technical geek and academic, I just love. Here I was sitting in my office right out of maternity leave, and I'm thinking, we are database people, but here is this very fuzzy world of big data. So we have Hadoop that people are using. So how can we tie it together to the products that we have and make it accessible to our customers? It was just at one point, one person's vision, idea on my whiteboard that is coming out today as a part of SQL Server 16. So that's exciting. It used to be that you would build software, thinking for a year, coding for a year, testing for a year. Instead, what we've been doing is engaging with customers early, before the features are even done, and using telemetry, both from our SQL Azure cloud offering and from SQL Server, to help us make decisions about the design of features before they're finished. We have been shipping the software in the cloud and on-premises. It's actually what we're doing, and no one else in the industry has done it. It's been really gratifying to see how much value uh, Microsoft has placed on open source and the open source community. I think it was unexpected in a way from a lot of the people that previously viewed the Microsoft ecosystem as being a very closed ecosystem. Today, being a very open ecosystem and reaching out into the open source community. The way I see cloud as any disruptive technology, it comes in, it disrupts, eventually it will become a commodity. And with the data, it's a similar approach. What we're doing is just building the software tools for people to be able to make sense out of it. Before, these tools were given to just experts. Today, you build the tools that a regular person could go crunch their numbers and make, again, an informed decision about it. And I think that's where the disruption comes in. Now with SQL Server 2016, your data is going to be safer than ever before. Your queries, your programs are going to run faster than ever before. And oh, by the way, faster than with any other system on the planet.